The Atlantic slave trade forced the migration of Africans to the Americas between the 16th and 19th centuries. Africans, British, French, and Dutch traders participated in the trade of people, products, and resources between Europe, Africa, and the Americas. This is known as the Triangular Trade Route. Millions of Africans were forced across the Atlantic during this slave trade. The first part of the Triangular Trade Route was between Europe and Africa. Europeans would trade finished goods and weapons to Africa. They would trade these finished goods for African people. These people were often captured as prisoners from conflicts between warring groups in Africa. The second part of the Triangular Trade Route was between Africa and the Americas. The second part, or middle part, is also known as the Middle Passage. People were traded between Africans and Europeans to the Americas. The Middle Passage was brutal for Africans. They faced horrible conditions on this route from Africa to America. They were forced into crowded ships that left them little room to move. They were treated like animals and chained together in the bottoms of the ships that they were transported on. Once they reached the Americas, they were traded for raw materials or natural resources. The third part of the triangular trade route was between the Americas and Europe. Africans were traded to America in return for raw materials or natural resources like cotton. These resources would be sent back to Europe to be turned into finished goods like clothing. These are the same goods that would be traded back to Africa to get more people to trade into slavery.